It's October 15th, 2020, first day of in-person early voting in my home state of North Carolina, and I am about to go cast my ballot. Now, I don't have to vote. I'm a middle-aged white dude. Doesn't really matter who the president is as far as whether or not I'm going to maintain my civil rights. I'm still going to be protected. But there are a lot of people in this country who so much of their right to even control their own body is on the line in this election. So yeah, I'm going to go vote. I'm going to go vote so that I don't have to send my children out of the room when the president comes on the TV screen out of fear that he's going to say something racist or sexist or talk about the size of his junk. Like, I am voting because I want to rebuild what I have always believed to be the greatest country in the world, America. I am voting because the president is a pathologically lying sociopath who would rather watch the entire world burn down than lose power or have his ego bruised or have someone say something mean about him. I'm voting because my senator, Tom Tillis, is so dumb that he can't even figure out how to spell his own name correctly. I am voting because my congressman, Ted Budd, owns a freaking gun store. Yeah, I don't think I need a gun store owner in Congress. I am voting because I want to live in a country that doesn't get laughed at by the entire world because our president is a game show host with a little man complex and too much orange makeup on. I'm voting because I want to see my friends protected. I'm voting because I want to see my daughter's right to decide what to do with her own body is protected. I'm voting because I care about America. I'm voting because I want to see this country be the best it can be. America's never been perfect. It's never going to be perfect. It's always been flawed. But the one thing that we've always done is slowly, a little bit at a time, gotten better. And in the last four years, so much of that has been reversed. So much of the progress that we've made has been wound back and destroyed, and it has to stop. We have to rebuild this country. We have to make America actually great for the first time. All the MAGA crap and all the crazy Trump supporters and all the QAnon conspiracies can't change reality. America is a great place, but it needs to be better. And it's only going to get better if we all do our part, if we all vote, if we all give people rides to vote, if we all encourage everyone else we know to vote. Our country's on the line this year, guys. It's up to us to literally save America. And I am begging you to join me. Go to the polls. Take the bus. Take your car. Ride a skateboard. I don't care. Just vote. Because our country really, really needs you right now. I love you all. Again, please vote.